Hey guys, we are here at Herculaneum today. It was actually discovered in 1709 and it was discovered before Pompeii, believe it or not. Anyway, this is actually a better preserved town. Although it's smaller than Pompeii, it only housed 5,000 people, but it was like a wealthy vacationer spot here in Italy. And we're gonna go check it out. Today we are at Herculaneum and we took the train to Sorrento from Napoli and we got off at Ercolano and the train ride was 250 each one way It's hard to believe these floors are pretty intact considering how old they are. Yeah. It's very pretty. It's gorgeous. It's hard to believe that's from like 79 AD.
this is the Grand Taberna. So I'm assuming this is a tavern. So I would have found this if I lived there. Might have been hanging out, having a few beverages. That's cool. All right, we've been in Herculaneum for two hours and we are heading out. It's a great place to visit. Compact, easy to get around. Uh, similar to Pompeii, I think the major difference is it's smaller and it doesn't have uh, the large theaters like Pompeii has. So Pompeii definitely has a different feel to it, more like a larger city where this is kind of like a small town. I hope you like this week's video. Come back next Thursday to see where our adventures take us. And as always, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment, do all of the things. It really does help our channel out. And we'll see you next Thursday. We hope you have a great weekend. Bye. Here's a travel tip for you. If you don't want to stand out like an American tourist, don't wear bright colors like me. Stick with browns or blacks or navies.